for watching again so today's video as you can see from the title I'm going to be talking about um, BoxyCharm and it's going to be um, I'm going to be showing you guys the month of May and the month of June since I just received my box and um, I wanted to talk to you guys about what it is for those of you guys who don't know um, it's just a monthly subscription that you get I um, for 20 $21.99 I believe and they give you five full products of makeup stuff that you can try and honestly I've been having this for about a year it would have been more but I had stopped working and um, I regretted it because they gave so much stuff away during that year that I didn't have it and um, I just wanted to say that because of this box here my makeup collection has grown because they send you like full-size products of good brands and stuff that you you know that either you want you've been looking at like stuff like that um, they send it to you and yeah without further ado I'm just gonna show you guys what we got in the box so to begin with I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how the box looks so let me just go ahead and put this back into place so I'm not gonna be able to close it perfectly but this is the box that you get sometimes it's a little bit bigger sometimes it's a little bit um longer i guess you can say and um this is the the month of may like i was saying and so you just open it and it looks like this and it comes with a card but i think i tossed that out already you guys i'm so sorry yeah I, okay so i tossed out the card already which i shouldn't have done but uh, I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys the products that we got. So the first thing that we come in the box, it looks like this on the inside. And let me see if I can find um, the box, okay? okay? So unfortunately, I can't find the little card um, that it comes with to tell me the products, what they're for, and how much they cost. But um, if I do find it, I'm going to go ahead and leave it down in the description box um, for you guys, like what the products are. And where did I leave my box? Oh my god. Hold on. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and start showing you guys the products that I have in here. And as we're going through the box, um, I did just my eyes already so I can show you guys some of the products and give you guys my first review on how I like um, the product. So the first thing that we got is the Glam Glow Gentle Bubble Daily Conditioning Cleansing Cleanser. And this is by, like I said, Glam Glow. And look at this thing, guys. This is not a sample size. This is an actual full-size product. And this is a, um, like I said, a daily conditioning cleanser. So let's go ahead and open this. And I'm not going to be trying this right now. I'm just going to be trying on the makeup. But um, this is what it looks like. I'm super excited about this. I've heard a lot of good things about Glam Glow. And honestly, I don't think I really have anything from their brand. So it has kind of like a, it smells like paint to me, nothing fancy, but we have that. And um, so these boxes come with four to five full size products. I've never gotten four products. I've always gotten five products. Um, so the next thing that we have in here is the lightweight eye luster cream eyeshadow. So that's what it looks like. I should have. I thought this was a lipstick. If not, I would have tried on this eyeshadow for you guys. But I'm going to go ahead and give you guys a swatch. So this is what it looks like. And it kind of has like a... I don't know. Like, it looks kind of like a metallic finish. I don't know if you guys can see that. And... Let's go ahead and give us a swatch. Oh, okay, so that's super pretty. Let's see if you guys can see. How do I show you guys? So it has like a purple undertone and then like, well it's, I guess it's purple and then you like tilt it and then it looks gold and then it looks purple and so yeah, so I thought that's pretty neat. So we have that and like I said again, this is a full size product. So moving on to the next thing that we got, we also got the Dose of Color Kiss of Fire Liquid um, matte lipstick. Now I've always wanted a dose of color lipstick and now I got one and I didn't have to pay $18 for them. This is what it looks like. Super pretty bright red and I'm going to go ahead and give you guys a 
swatch. So when you open it, it looks purple. I mean, I'm sorry, pink. Let's go ahead and swatch. Okay, so this is a really pretty color for summer. So it kind of has like that hint of like a bright pink, but then I'm pretty sure if you do a couple more layers, it'll be like a really blood red. So that is really pretty. I'm super excited about that. The next thing that I got, so that's three full size products. The next thing that I got is the Vintage by Jessica Leibskind. Leibskind. Hope I'm saying that right. And this is in the color Mocha. So it's just a lip liner. And I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys what that looks like. Super pretty. A very natural lip color. So yeah, that's nice. And the last thing that we got in the box is the LMR Cosmetics um, Blush Trio. So this is what it looks like. Super pretty. The colors are called Seclusion, Isla, and Toasted. So Seclusion going this way. So I think those are super, super pretty. So yeah, those are the five full-size products that we got in the box of May. And this is what it looks like. Now moving on to the box of June. That's the box that I'm most excited about. I feel like this has been one of their best boxes ever. And where's the rest of the stuff? Let's see, one, two, three, one, two. Okay. So moving on to this big box. Let me go ahead and show you guys what it looks like. I'll just close this so nothing falls out. Okay. This is the box. So if you guys can see, like they are like different sizes and see if I can close this up for you guys. So I think it just depends on the products that they send and like I said they send full size products so it's always um, like if you can see. So are you guys ready? Alright let's see. So first things first we got a Skin & Co Roma um, Truffle Therapy and this is a whipped cleansing cream which I'm super excited to try this. Um, I want to get into skincare, kind of just start taking care of my skin. I've never really, um, the most that I've done is just exfoliate my skin in the morning. And that's probably about it. So I think I, it's time. You know, it's that time where I really need to start um, taking care of my skin. The next thing that I have in here is the No Pore Problem. No Pore Problem. Prime is Essence and this is um, by the same brand of the other one that I got the one that I usually use and oh so it comes with this paper and then in the back it tells you everything and so let me start with going back to the skin um, this one it um, banishes dull skin with truffle therapy whipped cleansing cream this luxurious cream formula gently and effectively removes all makeup and impurities while hydrating dry and sensitive skin and this retails for $25 okay now you guys this box we get it all for $21.99 and this by itself retails for $25 that already is a win the next thing that we got here is um, the Touch and Sew No Problem Prime Essence and this lets your makeup stay a while with your new Touch and Sew No Problem Prime Essence and this is infused with um, Calendula Ofentulous Flowers Extract this primer tightens up your pores so it is um, sorry I lost my place where am I Oh, it tightens up your pores, keeping your skin silky, silky smooth. So we're going to go ahead and try this out today. See how that works. Because I love the other product, which is this one. We got this about two boxes ago. And look, look guys, I'm almost done with it. It's like, it's been two months already. So I was kind of excited when we got that one. The next thing that I have in the box is this uh, Dominique Cosmetics. And this is a lip gloss. And this retails for 17 and this one retails for 23 I don't know if I said that already so this one retails for 17 and she is a youtuber that I do watch and I 
do love her videos, so congratulations to her. I'm gonna go ahead and see how this smells. Okay, yeah, so this is the kind of smell that I would do if I ever had a lipstick line. It just smells kind of like vanilla-y. And if you guys know something about me, I love all vanilla scents. Everybody who knows me knows that I love scents like that. And it just looks like that. Super pretty. And this is in peach tea. So let's go ahead and give it a swatch. Just so you can kind of see. So it kind of has just like a really soft pink undertone. So we might be using this. I'm not sure whether I want to use this one or the red one. So we'll see right now. So that is the third product that we got in the box. The next product that we got in the box is, these are the Haru Haru Wonder Milky Berry Antioxidant Mask. And this is a trio pack. So you didn't get just one guys, you guys got three. We get three of these beauties. And um, I'm actually gonna try to try one out today and if I do, I might um, record it and see so I can give you guys a first review on how I like these. And this is a berry mask, so I wanna see how that smells. Yes, baby? Okay, hold on, okay? Okay, I'm good. And then the next thing, it's cool. Hold on, okay? Okay, so last but not least. Oh wait, the price on these. Where is the little paper? These go for nine dollars. Now I don't know if it goes for nine dollars each or nine dollars as a three. I'm pretty sure it's nine dollars as a three. And this is containing extracts of mckee berry. Um, this mask provides your skin with an antioxidants and anti-aging effects. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply all three of them at the same time because I do not want to get old. And this, um, no, I'm just kidding, guys. I'm not gonna do that. And yeah, so I guess it targets many skin imperfections. So yeah, I'm really super excited about that. Last but not least is my Tardius Pro Glow 3. And this is the cheek palette, you guys. So I didn't even know this existed. And I'm super excited because I love Tarte. And my sister showed me what we were getting. And I was just like, please, 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 I want to get that. You guys ready and this guys retails for you guys ready $45 guys $45 so this is what it looks like so pretty and then you open it like little I don't know it's like so cute so you open it like this what it looks like Oops. Okay. look at how beautiful that is guys so I'm super super excited to try this I'm gonna go ahead and try this right now when I do my face um, I just think it's super pretty and so yeah it just opens like that I'll show you guys again so it's like two little doors I don't want to scratch it Oops. so it just like opens and then it has two little mirrors on the side and I just think this is so beautiful it even smells beautiful okay so moving on to the face I'm gonna go ahead and start trying out some of these products that we got oh that is the last thing that I got in my boxy charm so if you guys like these kinds of videos go ahead and comment down below and I will be doing a monthly video on my boxy charm and what I got so now moving on to the makeup part of this video I'm gonna go ahead and start by moisturizing my face with the Olay complete lightweight daily fluid and um, I just like to use this because it has SPF 15 and if not my face gets really ashy around this part of my cheeks so I like to focus it right there just kind of moisturize this Sorry if you guys can hear my kids in the back. Okay. So, just like that. Let me 
gonna see if I can turn on my mirror. Just so I can see myself doing my makeup. Okay guys, so if you guys see me looking this way, it's because my mirror is right in front of me. So I just like to, um, like I said, moisturize my face. Next thing that I like to use, guys, is going to be the um, Needles No More, the No More Baggage by Dr. Brent. And I also got this in one of the boxy charms, and I'm almost done with it. I like this a lot because I feel like it really does make a difference. So, just go ahead and apply a little bit on my fingertips. The next thing that we're going to use is going to be the um, Luminizer Primer by Dr. Brandt as well. So I'm starting to be obsessed with this brand and everything that I've gotten from them, I get it from BoxyCharm. So I'm so happy that they introduced this um, brand to me. So like I said, I'm just going to squeeze some on there, but almost done with it. Just like that. And this is just to luminize the face. So I'm gonna apply this kind of like where I want like my face to be kind of highlighted. So on my forehead and then on the top parts of my cheeks. Just like that. And yes, these are stuff that I do apply every time I do my makeup. After that, I'm going to be applying um, the Nor Problem Primer, but I'm gonna see like if this is this is a prime essence. So let's go ahead and try this one, see how this one works. And this is supposed to eliminate your pores, so it looks like this. That's pretty cool. I think if I had a makeup line, I would like this color pink, and for it to be kind of see-through like that, I think that's really pretty. Girls, I'm just going to apply a little bit. Oh, so it's kind of like a, kind of like a liquid. Okay, so let's go ahead and just apply this. I'm gonna apply it mostly on my nose because I feel like that's where you can see most of my pores. Just like that. Sorry guys, I can't close the door because I'm here alone to make sure that I can hear the girls, but I'm pretty sure we can hear them a little too clearly now. Okay. So this kind of like, the smell, it doesn't really have like a fragrance to it, but it reminds me of summer, like sunscreen, which I do like how that smells. So, I like that, and instantly I can feel my face so much softer. So we're gonna go ahead and skip this one just to see how I like how this one feels. And usually I apply my um, Argan Vitamin E oils, but I just, I don't want to apply too much since we already applied the other one. And I do want to see how I like this one. So I'm not going to apply this one. So we got that one. And then on top of that, now we're going to apply the foundation and my concealer. Now I don't have a concealer, which I need to buy. Um, like at least one that I like. If that makes sense, so I'm gonna be using this one by MAC, and this one is the um, NC30 concealer, and I feel like this just doesn't really brighten up under my eyes. So I'm just going to do kind of like that. closing the door just because they are being a little bit too loud so um, they're okay I put a movie on for them okay guys oh so I'm gonna be using the um, matte poreless fit me foundation and this is the only one honestly that I feel like I have liked except for I tried one a while back and it's the Ulta brand one and I did like it so I think I need to go back and try it again 
so yeah so I just like to kind of like dab little marks on my cheeks Now I'm going to be using my sponge and um, I'm just going to start dabbing in all of the product sponge and um, I'm just going to start dabbing in all of the product. So the next thing that I'm going to take is I'm going to take my Marc Jacob and this is the Perfection Powder and I'm just going to apply this um, under my eyes. So just so it doesn't crease up. Just like that and next um, in the palette let's see I'm gonna go ahead and use the Tardius Pro um, glow palette so excited okay and I think for today I'm going to use the Luxie 522 taper um, this is a highlighter brush so I'm actually gonna use that one to highlight and for my bronzer, this one. okay, so I'm going to use the Luxie 660 Precision Foundation. So I guess this is a foundation brush, so I'm going to be using it for my bronzer. And I'm going to take the, so this is like a matte color and this is like a shimmer color. So I'm going to be taking the matte color and applying it to the hollow parts of my face. Yeah, that is so pretty guys this is like a sun-kissed finish bronzer it's not too heavy on the skin it's like just like that summer sun-kissed look that you can that every girl I'm pretty sure wishes to have And I'm like barely pressing it onto the powder and it's coming off really good so Let's see hopefully you guys can see so when applying my bronzer I just kind of like to like pucker my lips and turn to the side just so I can see that hollow part and I just kind of like brush it upwards instead of brushing it down where I bring it down too low I kind of just like to brush it upwards like starting towards the middle and then you know brushing it upwards and then I'm just going to take whatever I have extra and I'm just going to put it on the temples of my forehead just like that okay and so now I'm going to take the highlighting brush and I'm going to use it to apply some blush and I think I'm going to go with the lighter one so. yeah that's super like a natural look guys yep I love it 
this and then I'm just going to kind of like brush off any of the excess excess um what is this blush I'm sorry and then we're going to do the the highlight and I think I'm gonna go with the more like a champagne look and I'm just going to like kind of glide it down like that and here we go super pretty love that this is something that I would wear all over my face and nothing on my eyes just maybe a little bit of waterproof mascara which I am going to be going to um, a pool resort on Monday so I might maybe do a look for you guys on how I would do my makeup or how I am going to do my makeup so yeah so that is how I um, did the face now I'm just going to um, move on to my eyebrows and then I'm gonna go ahead and come back and finish off with the okay, guys so I just finished off my um, eyebrows off camera I didn't do nothing too um, drastic I just kind of like built in the little parts that are like little ball parts in the eyebrows and just to kind of fill them in like I said nothing too drastic now we're gonna go ahead and move on to the lips I think I want to keep it kind of um, natural looking which I know this is what I always do guys and don't worry I'm gonna go ahead and come up with some more um, dramatic looks that we can do for you guys in the summer so yeah so I'm gonna be using the Dominique Cosmetics lip gloss just because I'm super excited to try this out because it smells really good and I'm gonna go ahead and try the lip liner that we got in the in May's box so this one is vintage by Jessica and this is in the color mocha so let's go ahead and try this out see how it looks So right away by lining out my lips, this is very smooth. Because to me, my lips are always super dry. But this just feels like it's gliding on. So I like to just kind of line it out like that. Now I'm going to just draw the line. As you can see, like I have like this little line here. So I'm just going to intensify it. And these are just like the natural creases of my lips, which I like to intensify. Just so they look a little bit more plump okay and then we're gonna go ahead and take the um this is called peach tea so excited it smells so good I'm just gonna go ahead and spritz some of my aloe plus um, rose water onto my face just to kind of set all of the makeup in. I love the smell. It just reminds me of summer. Love summer. Okay, so this is the final look. 
hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you guys in my next video bye